The Bears just got embarrassed in Chicago. They allowed 38 points to Jordan Love without Christian Watson playing. The defense was just pathetic. The offense looked even more vanilla than it did in the preseason, and the entire team just let us down. The play calling was embarrassing, and honestly, the effort was also embarrassing. Where was the hits philosophy? We were in this game at halftime, and I expected second half adjustments and some energy and passion coming out of the locker room. What we got in the second half was a flat performance from the entire team. We couldn't convert on third downs, the play calling was just strange, and we let Jordan Love and the Packers march up and down the field for touchdowns. But the most disappointing thing was that we didn't even have the identity that we fought so hard to establish last season. The hustle and the hits principle, it wasn't there. The number one rushing attack in the NFL last year wasn't there. The DJ Moore effect on offense was non-existent most of the day. You have to question the play caller when you fail to establish any kind of identity on offense and you aren't able to get DJ Moore involved. He caught back-to-back -back first downs early in the game and then nothing for three quarters, not a single target. Meanwhile, Chase Claypool was also a non-factor. Two targets, zero catches, the boos were loud throughout Soldier Field and well-deserved. I've never been one to overreact after week one of the season, Throughout NFL history, week one is almost always proven to be an outlier. But honestly, this was one of the most disappointing losses in my life as a Bears fan. Jordan Love had a better game than Rodgers did in his first start against us. Our defense just looked awful. Our offense lacked urgency. I have serious and legitimate questions about Luke Getze. I'm not going to make any excuses for Justin Fields, but that play calling job had shades of Matt Nagy. There is no way you can watch successful offenses like the 49ers, Packers, and Dolphins run this same scheme and think that Luke Getze did even an average job at play calling. Part of the reason we dealt with the lack of passes last year is because Getze and Eberflus preached about establishing this identity. Where was that identity today? This is supposed to be a new era of Bears football, but after the first game, we are left with an empty feeling of this pit in our stomach that is oh so familiar and doesn't feel like a new era. I'm not giving up on this season. It's one game. But it was a home game against the Green Bay Packers with Jordan Love. So for most of us fans, it felt like a lot more than one game. But at the end of the day, we are just 0-1. And we need to see some answers from Luke Getze in this offense next week and the defense. We travel to Tampa Bay to play the Buccaneers. They beat the Vikings today with Baker Mayfield. And if the Bears come out looking as flat as they did today, they won't win next week either. I need to see this team come back with some energy and passion next week. I need to see Luke Getze scheme some shots down the field. And I need to see Allen Williams call a better defense. And Eddie Jackson bounce back and play better. He's supposed to be a leader and captain on this team. We have back-to-back -back road games coming up. I will be studying the All-22 tape no matter how much I dislike it. I have to see what Luke Getze was doing with these play calls, and I have to see if Justin had guys open downfield or not. There's a lot of things I just have to see on tape. This is about the worst possible scenario for week one. Justin Fields had 275 total yards, one touchdown and one interception, but the stats don't really represent the game. As the Packers shut down our rushing attack, and Getze didn't really open up the offense until we were down three scores. How we bounce back next week is everything, though. Stay tuned, guys. I will be back covering everything, Chicago Bears. Keep your head up, and let's hope this team can respond with a big win next week. Until next time, bear down. Do-rag, Jay. Do-rag, Jay. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, good work today, baby. Let's keep going. Here we go. Bears on three. One, two, three. Bears.